like we never left BDA. And yo, this episode of One Punch Man, you know, I wish I had done a live reaction to it, honestly. That's how good it was. Obviously, I wouldn't put the video on, you know, in the video as far as the, the, the content, but it was really good. Like, we got introduced to most of the S class prisoners. Um, my mask was not there. Uh, not prisoners, S class heroes, but my mask wasn't there. And Metal Knight wasn't there as well. But pretty much what happened, they called the emergency meeting, and these different heroes and the different type of personalities that are there, that was super interesting. The pig god, I saw tank top god as well, and tank top god, I'm assuming it's like a tank top guy for each level. I think someone mentioned that in one of my videos before, that they're going to be a tank top guy for every class. So seeing tank top guy, that was interesting because he even said, Saitama, that sounds familiar because you no know, Saitama took care of tank top tiger and I forget the other tank top guy. We took care of both of those guys. So it, that was interesting. Now, Saitama is, gets invited to this meeting because he just happened to be there, right? Because they were training with um, Zeno from Hunter Hunter. And I forget his name, but this, the old guy, you know, you know the old guy, the old hero, I forget his name. I, damn, I can't remember his name, but whatever, the old guy and Geno. So then Geno and the old guy get summoned. They're like, um, the old guy realizes that Saitama is stronger than him. He's like, he's going to be a top to S class soon, so he might as well come. His talent will get him there. Now, um, we get invaded. They get invaded by aliens, apparently. And now we had this swordsman going in on the ground against them. Saitama, Genos actually went to Saitama to ask him, yo, Les, we should probably go do this. Saitama's already out the roof and about to attack the aliens. So he, he already invaded their ship. The asshole samurai, man. Like, he was like, I'm not going to acknowledge you till you get to S class. Like, dude, why you gotta be an asshole? Like, people, people are just assholes, bro. The different quirks of these um heroes, man, that was definitely interesting. Even um Storm, uh, the number two ranked, like how she casually disposed of that dinosaur where she can summon meteors. I'm like Fuji in this bitch, bro. It's like the stuff she was able to do. That was crazy, dope. How she did that, man. I was like, that, that's 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 kind of cool that she can just summon a meteor because um Genos classified her as a as an esper. So the fact that she could do that, she's pretty powerful. Saitama's right now on the ship. He's running through it, and he's taking care of it like a uh, a video game. He's like, "Yo, the boss isn't gonna show up. Like, we're, like, where's the boss, man?" I'm definitely looking forward to next episode because we see this guy with one eye, like he's the Millennium. He has the Millennium. He has the Millennium Eye. So I don't know if it's um, Yami, <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh. I don't know who it is right now, bro. But he looks like a badass just sitting there, and he had explosions going off around him. So. So it's, it's definitely going to be great and get interesting because finally, hopefully, they recognize Saitama is a monster. Yeah, great stuff though. Let me know what you thought about the episode. What was your favorite part? Who was your favorite hero? Because the favorite new hero for me, I don't know, that random black guy was hilarious. Like he's just super scared. And King was cool as well. Because King, you, you kept hearing his heartbeat. Like, doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo. that was awesome. So yeah, let me know what you thought about the episode, guys. Great stuff. One Punch Man never disappoints. So I'm enjoying it. Um, like the video if you did though. Um, subscribe. That would be dope. Have a good day, people.